hello everyone this is imran here welcome back to our channel and today we are going to talk about how to use zendrop with shopify so as a beginner i believe we all need to know about zendrop because zendrop is very huge market and especially it's an international market so there are some things which we need to know right so zendrop is an e-commerce marketplace that connects reliable supply suppliers with online merchants and drop shipping stores so what we're we going to do that we can see over here like we can add apps right this is my shopify account so uh we are just going to click on it and click on shopify app store right down below once you click on it it will open new tab and you will find multiple apps over here over here also so what we are going to search then drop right then drop then drop global drop shipping once you click on it add app it will take some time but eventually it will work and here we are install app so now we are at zen drop dashboard and as you can see they are asking for my password and my monthly revenue so i'm just going to sign up with that and here we are so as you can see over here this is a very clean and uh, very minimal way to uh, look after like the product you desire so as you can see we can scroll down and we will find more or of, more of them so on the left side we have more options like dashboard import list uh, imported products orders which we will talk about some of them over here and there are some more so what we are going to do so before we go further we just need to know like uh, from here you can see ships from anywhere so if you click on it you can see that we can find ships from us ships from china so if you click on ship from us you will find every single product from usa so if we scroll down this is all from usa and you can just use them uh to like obviously to send to your customer so obviously we will talk about this later so i'm just letting you know that uh, if you think that usa uh is good for your shipping or china is good for your shipping wherever you are going to live like wherever you are living so it's all new whatever you are going to choose so after that we have all categories obviously you can just uh choose any category you want and whatever you are working on especially so for this tutorial i'm just going with like a sports and entertainment uh you can find this over here like only us only have this <laughs> and uh, otherwise we have more options over here like sports and outdoors and you can see over here so these are some things which you can use for your or like for your own purpose right so you can see the suppliers what suppliers you can just go ahead and do that like go ahead and choose from that zendra fulfillment also there long jerky is it's all on you price range if you want to choose or uh, like minimal price range for the starter you can also choose so right now we need to understand how we are going to put these products from here to our shopify account right so let's just say i want to ship from usa and i want to ship um or we can go with the like different categories like uh gaming so we get this nintendo switch uh joy con replacement and you can see that uh they are like usa estimated shipping time is 20 to 30 days for economy and uh, it will cost zero but obviously it's unavailable because zero cost doesn't matter and it's disabled and regular is one to two days 4.20 international and uh, international shipping is off so let's just say you want this uh like nintendo joy account replacement on your shopify account so how you are going to do that you can just scroll down right beside uh, this place and order uh we can find that add to import list so once you click on it you can see it has been imported how you can see on the left side here import list and there's one thing over here click on it and you will end up right over here so this is where you are going to edit every single thing which will display on your website on your shopify account so as you can see over here i'm uh, like i could just say like uh, analog and analog and that's it we can just uh obviously uh, add tags add type add collection if i want to and it's all on me right 
go to description change the description you you have a lot of things you can change and uh, you can uh, do a lot of things over here you have variant so what is variant let's just suppose this uh, black color uh, is not only here you can find multiple colors like red green white yellow uh, on this product right so obviously we are just going to put that on our website so if there are some variants for this particular product you can see over here right down below and you can just like them right down here you can see the shipping cost the product cost and it costs around 6.59 and even though it is 6.59 you will get 0.29 dollar obviously you can just increase it if, if you want and it's all on you right so go to images then and you can see you can choose you can even choose uh, images also like what images you want to display so after that just click on import to store and it will be disappear where it will go to my shopify account go to shopify go to products and you will find that over here as you can see it is active click on it and you can see more details over here you can just write description you can just write title uh, product status is active or not uh, you, uh, you want to uh, draft it if you want like disable if you want it's all on you you can schedule it there are multiple options which you can choose for yourself and color is black and that's it this is how you are going to put this over here and then after that you are going to obviously advertise it and uh, like on google ads or facebook ads it's all on you where are you going to advertise this product so after that you need to understand like uh, if someone's going to order this product right from our shopify so how we get notified obviously shopify will email you or get not like give you a notification but how we can get access to like what they want so obviously it won't appear over here it will appear on zendra because everything works from over here we get the stuff from over here so you can just go on order and you will find all the details if some like if i'm going to order something from my shop shopify account it will end up over here because actually i got that product from zendrop right so zendrop got the orders and if, if you want to add uh, like auto fulfillment what is auto fulfillment uh like uh, if you turn on this auto fulfillment uh zendrop will identify customer and their address details and they will uh, put them by themselves and get started by themselves you don't need to come over here and manually fulfill them uh, or automatically full, uh, like you know uh, like what i want to say like just uh, you don't need to come over here and write down their addresses individually so how you can get this i cannot even click it because uh, this is a premium feature and you can just upgrade it from over here as you can see this is a free plan so unfortunately you might need this we have some uh, pricing over here you can see hundred dollar four hundred dollars and if you go ahead and watch over here you can see the monthly fees like uh, for fifty dollar and eighty dollar and that's it so these are some monthly fees which you need to pay and there are some more resources which you can get some more features you can get with plus features or pro features so it's all on you what are you going to do so that's it this is all you need to know how you can use Zendrop with Shopify. I hope you understand everything I have said. Thank you for watching this video and leave a like and subscribe. Bye bye.